a servant of god i am robert simon beloved in christ loving greetings our faith must be incredible faith and invincible faith and not incredulous faith jude writes about another type of faith which is totally different from what we have been considering we shall go to jude chapter 1 and read verses 3 and 4 verse 3 beloved when i gave all diligence to write unto you of the common salvation it was needful for me to write unto you and exhort you that you should earnestly contend for the faith which was delivered unto the saints verse 4 For there are certain men crept in unawares who were before of old ordained to this condemnation ungodly men turning the grace of our lord into lasciviousness and denying the only lord god our lord jesus christ what we read here you should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints what is this faith The word faith appears in our King James version nearly 247 times and belief and its conjugal forms appear 265 times altogether 512 times to have a meticulous word study of all these 500 and more uh, occurrences of this concept faith will be very huge gigantic and enormous we nevertheless this day consider the word faith in jude chapter 1 verse 3 jude in no uncertain terms exhorts us that we should earnestly contend wrestle one against another for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints here the concept is entirely and totally different Here faith means the totality of Christian doctrines we should earnestly contend for this faith or for the integrality and entirety of the teachings and doctrines which were once delivered unto the saints unto the apostles the reason imputed for this one to one wrestling is given in verse 4 For there are certain men crept in unawares who were before of God ordained to this condemnation ungodly men turning the grace of our God into lasciviousness turning the grace of our God into lasciviousness and denying the only Lord God and our Lord Jesus Christ what is this perversion of the truth If it was a problem in the first century apostolic church it can be left to no one's own imagination what would be the size and shape of the problem today earnestly contending for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints be aware in a faceable faith in our minds and spirits Let me say this again earnestly contending for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints be aware in a faceable faith in our minds and spirits questions comments remarks views feedbacks reflections are welcome before we god willing could move on to another word till then god bless you god be with you i am yours robert simon